Hey everyone and welcome to another edition of Farming Simulator 2017. Uh, this is Jim and uh, before we start I'm going to apologize, apologize for uh, not being here for a couple months. Uh, I did have a few things that happened that, uh, well I was I was able to look at videos and watch videos and play games but I could not make any videos so uh, I'm just going to leave it at that for right now and um, uh, yeah, yeah we're going to get into that something else here. Uh, today, uh, as the title probably shows you, I'm going to show you how to do uh, uh, leveling and uh, compacting using course play. And now this is a new uh, level or a, a mode, if you will, of uh, course play. And uh, I have it open here, right here. It's the last one on the, on the end there, pardon my French, right here. Uh, this one, leveling and compacting. Um, basically, what it does is just do just that. It just levels levels your silos and bunkers uh, to and compacts it, so uh, you can just walk away from it, let it let it be in, be done by uh, force play. Now the thing is, um, it's a little buggy still. You have to do everything right, and hold your tongue right to get it all working right, and. Um, Occasionally it will go bonkers on it, like I say, bonkers on you, but it is a work in progress as a course play is itself. Uh, but this one excites me, really does. Um, when you do it by yourself, at least this is what I found. <laughs> this is how I level it out here. <laughs> okay, well, okay, that's that's about as best best I can do. But with the leveling mode, this is what you get get from there. Now this is 600 liters. Yeah, 600 liters of chaff that has been blanketed, it's been uh, compacted, leveled, and compacted um, to uh, to this point right here, and compacted 100% to where it gets uh, a blanket over it, so it'll, it's uh, turning fermenting to uh, turn into silage. I'm all excited about this, <laughs> um, but that's that's what it looks like afterwards. Now that's I think the level of this uh, bunker is 900,000. I did not um, wait until I got up to that level. I got 600,000 in there. <clears throat> so, as you can, so as you can see, it does go over over the top, but it doesn't spill over. So we'll see what it looks like when it turns into silage. Um, <clears throat> this is another one that I've started on. Um, you can see it, that it uh, does a pretty good job of leveling it and compacting it also. Where are we at now? 82%. That's eighty thousand liters almost. So, yeah, this is this is um, it can be all, all all automated for you now. So I'm going to show you how to do this now. This is the uh, the tractor part of it, and basically what you're going to do is go down here to the to your silo or to your bunker, whatever you want to call it. You go to go down to about a quarter way there now. Um, yeah, that looks good right there. And you're going to start your course from there. Make sure you're in the uh, leveling and uh, compacting mode. Start your recording. Go forward and then go out just to the right a little bit. Just like that. And I'll show you why here in a minute. Now you want to set a wait point by hitting the P. You want to hit back. Or reverse. And what you want to do is come up to about right, right around here. And try to make it a little bit more centered than that. And that is your leveling and compacting course right there. So that is silo four. Now it's all ready to go. Uh, I want to see if it's going to work. Oh, we, all, we can also set all the uh, levels here. Uh, like I said, the mode is leveling and compacting. There's also, and it's a work in progress, as I said before. Uh, it's also a filling up. I have no idea what that is. I'll know, know uh, soon though. Uh, automatically stop for uh, uh, all everything with a running engine or just course players. Now what that means is is that if you have car, uh, uh, tractors with trailers coming from the fields with loads of chaff, um, if, as this is working, as this is working back in here, It'll come up here to a point and it'll stop because that truck, that tractor is waiting and it stopped and waiting. This tractor has told that tractor to stop. 
So what it does is it goes out here to this 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 edge on the side here. And we took a road, road trip to the right there, and it'll park until your course play, your tractor with the chaff in it, comes in and dumps it and then moves away. As soon as it moves away, he backs up to this point here and starts all over again as far as compacting. So, you know, uh, it it's so far they've got this thing dialed down pretty darn good. Now, uh, detecting the tractors in the range of, uh, right now it's the uh, default is 50 meters. Uh, if you want it to do any closer or further away, uh, you can do that there. But working with, uh, you do have to change this, the default is three, three meters. Um, the leveling blades are six meters, so you want to change that to six. Um, max speed while pushing will be um, automatic, and that's 15 miles an hour. Um, what I've found, and what a few others have found to me, was change that to about eight MPHs. Now, um, according to Mr. Moose, this is kilometers. So when you go down to here, it'll be backing up about three, three miles an hour, three to four miles an hour. So that's a fair uh, speed to go back to there. You'll get a lot more done that way. Uh, your blade height, you want to keep it automatic. Um, as this level here of your chaff grows, the blade will go up and, and change, and that's that's uh, that's what you need. So, let's see if this works here in this this mode. I'm, I may have to redo this one. Nope. What it's going to do is go back down here, and it's going to lower the blade. Yeah, it's it's got the blade up as high as it is, looking for uh, looking for chaff. And it'll go back to about, well, right where you see that those hills right there. It'll go right here, and then it'll move forward. And then basically, right now, I think it's it, what it's going to do is go over here to the right. Yeah, it's going to go to the to the waypoint, and then it's going to come back and do uh, play the way on the right, and then the one on the left also. Okay, so that's setting up that. Uh, I don't know why it's not moving. Oh, it's that's because there's nothing in there. That's that's why it's not moving any further. So I'm going to stop this driver here. Uh, okay, I'm going to take this one out and we're going to go to silo 3. Now this one actually has chaff in it. You see what it's doing, it's going down. Now this part is already leveled off, so you're not gonna see too much action on, on this this side. Actually on either side because it's that's been uh, compacted pretty good. So that's basically what, what the uh, comp the uh, level and compacting mode does on course play. Now, uh, I think what we're going to do is I'm going to show you, I just ran into the side of the wall there. Um, I'm going to show you what it, uh, how to set up for the uh, course play from the field, okay? I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back on uh, field 5 and field 13, that's behind me there. And uh, I'm going to show, show one uh, course play to the BGA from both fields. So I'm going to pick a pretty common uh, starting point. First, better open up uh, course play. What do you think? Be on combi mode. Start your recording. And we're going to head to the BGA. Turn off your trains. If you cross any tracks, because uh, they will send your tractor and trailer halfway down the tracks. I know. We just made it. Now 
know if this tractor was was doing any leveling at all down here. By the time you got here down here, you would be stopped by, by riding here. So basically what we're gonna do is remember now you've when you when this is being done, you will have a trailer on the back of this, so you want to back accordingly. So you want to kind of straighten it up a little bit. Let's back straight down the uh, the uh, the bunker here, and about a quarter of the way. That looks good right there. Now we go forward from here. Now see that that uh, last arrow there was where the back of the trailer would be not the uh, tractor, so... <laughs> now we're going to just save it here. I'll we'll go, um... Fields 5, five and 13. Uh, chaff. To BGA. Okay, one thing I did forget to mention, <clears throat> excuse me, um, for this you're going to have to make a, co a, a course play course from the field to each silo because it's not like the other ones where you could drive through all the silos at one time and it would empty in this one and not this one and, and, and so on and so forth uh, <clears throat> like in 15 did. <clears throat> excuse me. So, just remember you have to do that. It's, uh, it's not that big a deal. So, um, <clears throat> I'm going to show you what it's going to look like uh, with a load of chaff going to the BGA. I have turned off the train. Mm, it's up there. So I did, did turn off the train, so we're not going to be bothered with it. There's no traffic on this road anyway until you get past the BGA. So, uh, shouldn't have any inter interference. Now, okay, we're, we're heading into the, uh, uh, into the BGA now. We're heading down the hill. We have a tractor that is doing the leveling. So now it's see that now I didn't do a thing. The tractor told us to stop, and because I had it when, when I turned it turned it on, I changed it to just course play. So, uh, in other words, if if another vehicle came down here that wasn't course play, it wouldn't stop the tractor from doing its thing. So now it's going to go move out of the way. As soon as it stops, it's going to signal this tractor. To do its thing. It's going to 
back down the the, uh, the uh, silo, the bunker, bunker <coughs> to where that last orange marker was. And it's going to empty, and it's going then then it's going to head out and and head back to the field to pick up another load. So once it gets out of the way, it sends a message to this tracker, I'm gone. And she's going to go back here and start leveling out what he just brought in. She, I don't know. I say he, but he could have her. Let's see how easy that works. Now you're compacting also as you go along. Of course, you know, with this tractor, it's not that, done left a lot of weight on it. But most of the compacting comes back here also. Like I said, it goes back to that certain point. And then it'll go over to the other side. And it'll just, it'll just keep doing that up and down, up and down, up and down until, until you stop it, actually. Um, Okay, so that's leveling and compacting on uh, with course play on Farming Simulator 2017. Now, I'll be honest with you, I found out this uh, about this um, mode of uh, Farming Simulator uh, course play uh, off of a video I saw from Iron uh, Robson or Iron Robson. I forget now how he says his name, but anyway, him. And then uh, I saw a video from Mr. Moose. Who showed me how to do this and so this is not my doing even though I tried I tried like heck to figure out how this worked I couldn't uh, and I saw Mr. Moose's uh, video so I thought well I'll put, put it out to my guys so you guys will see how this works and uh, start having fun with it, it can be automatic um, automated just know that it is still in beta it's uh, it's uh, not perfect yet but um, Hey, none of us are, and so far this is this has been working out pretty good. So thanks for watching. Again, sorry we uh, I haven't been around lately, but uh, I'm back. We'll talk to you later. Bye.